Okay, so I'm on the way to the t-shirt guy. Luckily, he is right around the corner from me. We don't buy them from China at 99 cents a piece that are made from cobwebs. We buy from our local guy. I've been dealing with him for 20 plus years. In fact, that box on the back of his truck is for us right there. Now, just to give you an idea, Bruce kind of made fun of him because it sounded like he had a cold the other day. So Bruce was busting his shop saying that he has COVID and he's a super spreader and everything else. So he's kind of gave him a complex. So I have a check. I'm probably just going to write the check and throw it through his door because if he does have COVID, I don't want to go in there. Now, I have a mask anyway, whether you're an anti-mask mask, I don't care. That's not what it's about. A couple colors on the floor. Yeah, just a couple. Yeah, just proving that we're not in China. Right. We don't have our stuff made in China. It's too far to drive. It's too far. Awesome. Cool. Okay. All right, buddy. We'll see you later. All right, buddy. See you. All right. Box is in. Let's go back to the shop. Esther is like wow. eagerly awaiting these. That's the key. Can't find much. I hate to have to do my truck key. Oh, we sanitized the box too. Oh, you did? Couldn't find my truck key. I left the stupid thing running. I never do that. Yeah, key's right here. But yeah, he seems fine, but you never know. I guess he was sneezing the other day <laughs> and Bruce immediately uh, said, that's it. He's got COVID. T-shirt guy's got COVID because Bruce delivers here. I mean, this is where the shop is. This is our street down here. You see how close he is? And I've been dealing with him since 1997. That's a long time, right? What was you doing in 1997? I was getting shirts printed with LHT Performance on it with a, a much older logo. It's evolved a little bit since then, but same guy, John at Superitech, great guy. He's a friend of mine. I stay loyal. Whoa. Look at that. Wow. That is pretty trick, isn't it? It's a good time. Look at that. I love it. Black is deceiving. Black is deceiving. That is cool. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> I've been watching The Office. I've, seen, I've heard a lot of those jokes. So we have, what, medium, large, and extra large in the, uh, the LHT with the S2000 silhouette. Now, got to give a big thank you to Brian at Monaco Auto Design. He uh, took care of us on these i asked him to make us this and he said you know what it's on its way so we have large we have extra large then we have medium and we have some 2x's guys somebody has asked me for 2x and he's asked me many times so hopefully you watch this and you go you know what that's my shirt right there 2x and these are jerseys. These are that real nice cotton that we've been wearing. George and I have the shirts on. It's super duper nice. It's lightweight. It's not cheesy. It's not crappy. It's beautiful material. So we have two, two X's. So you're going to get one of those shirts. What size do you want, Esther? I know you like to run them a little bit large. I don't know. So you want an extra small? I would definitely, I definitely extra. want an extra small. Do you want a two X so you can sleep in it? No, I think this large will be just fine because I like to cut it. If I get it too big, it will. You fall better off not shoulders. cut that down. We just got it. It's get a new it. design. Cut it right up. <laughs> Don't cut it up. I don't, I don't too nice it's to cut. Too, it's too hot when it's all like this. It all right, so we're like... going to put these up on the store. Hopefully, by the time you watch this video, they're in the store. You can go and buy them. And we have some other ones in here too. We have the LHT Classic right here let's not get these all over the floor but let's dig the rest out then Esther is going to start trying some stuff on but these are our classic LHTs just like the blue one kind of like just like the one I'm wearing right now in blue we have it in black but it's got we gray. have some more yeah this is like a sparkly silver we didn't want sparkly on the black because we thought it might look a little bit a little bit yucky so this is gray it's not obnoxious but this is our classic LHT in black we're gonna have some more in blue and then of course the lht with the new logo with the new s2000 on the front this is so sweet and some hoodies which are just not here the hoodies are on the way 
they are on the way they're in black too so we're gonna have a whole lineup of black so you guys ask for it go ahead and start clicking start buying and we will start packing that's it look at that that's a good looking shirt right there all right i want to take some snapshots of it and put it on the site then we're going to get one each i feel like you're so close i know well it's a gopro so it's got a really wide angle so this oh, okay. is actually you see it fills the screen oh okay so it's really so not that it's not it's not that bad it just looks terrible so we're going to get one each so you're going to get one i'm going to get one yep. george is going to get one and the rest are going up on the store so okay. you're going to use our little banner here let me get a couple of pictures of you we'll put it up on the store All of the packing that came out of here is back in this over here was hollow right yeah it was kind of hollow in there this is an x these pieces are perforated they have an x it yeah. was hollow on the edges and in between it so everything that came out of it is now pushed back in and of course we need it to sit flat now what we're going to do is put the new piece on and tack it every inch in a sequence to try and keep it from twisting these over here have a slight radius to them just because they're a stamped end. This is cut straight, this is cut straight. So we're gonna put a tack, every one of these to keep it nice and flat and then start welding in a sequence, but should be quite a bit less of a profile. Look at that, that's pretty cool. if we really wanted to. Yeah. So this is what we call clamp on clamp. Double clamp. When you don't have a clamp long enough. So now we have it tacked pretty much all the way around every three or four inches or so. Basically just gonna split the difference, tack between it. Uh, we're going to have to wipe the ink off, but it's all pretty, all pretty tight. This way I usually wear it, sweatshirt underneath. This is uh, in the store also. I'm really digging these shirts. So I did the S2000 silhouette ones, done this one right here. You go ahead and get these in the store and hopefully you guys will start buying them. I'm digging them. What do you think, you like them? All right, these are your personal shirts, George. You have one with a silhouette and one classic. Awesome. All right, I'll go throw them in your shirt. In your, in your shirt. Yeah, I'm a little dirty. I'll go throw them in your car. All right, it should be open. All right, if not, hit the button. All right. 
So one of the perks of working here is we don't have to buy clothes because everything is LHT shirt related. If I was to start selling shorts, I would be made. I wouldn't have to buy clothes again. All right, so putting some of these on the store right now. Esther just left, so I am going to be uh, loading these. She did the last ones, but I kind of know how it works. This is what Esther is listening to in the background with all of these windows open. So let me, here's the inventory. It tells us actually what we got there, what we ordered. Took two off, one for me and one for George and Esther. Got one of the large S2000 silhouette shirts. She really liked that, and I do too. <laughs> I This is like one of those crazy things. I really like this stuff. So Esther got a large, George and I got a extra large each. So that's what's in the store. We do have two extra larges. Part of the payments too, of course, credit cards. Some credit cards charge more than others. And it's like, whoa, sometimes you get a credit card and they're charging 5%. So it's kind of like you win and you lose. We're using USPS mainly for our lower end uh, items. Uh, so we can keep the shipping down. We're just eating the fee. And again, it's a learning lesson, but we're doing pretty good. And I'm excited if this does build, of course, we're not going to be anywhere near, you know, Matt from Obsessed Garage. But I do want to thank him for giving me some motivation and some some kind of pointers to get this happening. This is still playing in the background, by the way. So we just picked up more LHT Master Cylinder Braces. Again, these are billet aluminum CNC machined, made in the United States, engraved anodized everything's done in the u.s we don't uh, don't farm this out and these are quality pieces uh, we used to offer a sheet metal version in fact this is our very early in fact this is the first sheet metal one we offered and we changed this eventually went up to four millimeter steel and we found that it still flexes that's why we discontinued the steel and i guess it's flattery but i keep seeing new companies coming out with sheet metal ones on ebay and they look as cheesy as this one which is the very first one from about 10 years ago and then this was the first one i made aluminum to make it a little bit beefier we did a little testing on this and again it's counterboard it's not obviously as pretty as the newest design but this was just made by hand just so we could test it this one didn't flex this one is obviously a little bit thicker material it's 100 percent one piece where this one's kind of built and welded and changed and messed around with this one is much nicer Talking of which is our LHT solenoid cover, again black, anodized, got the LHT logo, matches our master cylinder brace and our battery tie, and now our new black t-shirt line. So now we have like a whole series of black parts. So I am working on a new license plate frame. I've actually ordered a bunch of these. I've had probably five or six and I keep playing with them. This is the one I've settled on that I like, and it is powder coated, it's a nice piece. So I'm going to see about getting our logo on this. And again, it's not kind of the, I want to sell every single thing I can possibly imagine with our name on it. But the people that like to support us, I want to offer parts. And this is, of course, for us as well. I'm going to put one on my cars. I'll give one to George, one to Esther. So it's kind of nice for us. But if people want to buy them, of course, I want to sell them. And again, another part that's black. I'm kind of digging this whole Black Series stuff. All right, so now we have our shirts inventoried. I'm going to put them back in the box to keep them clean. And as we sell them, pull them out one at a time. That way they come to you brand new. So let me get them on the store and they're ready to buy. So thank you so much for supporting us. Thank you for buying our products. Thank you for watching and helping us grow. And we'll see you on the next video.